she likes, what she likes And she could put it all on you, baby If you bout that life, bout that life Because you don't got time to choose it Hey tribe, it's Kia from Heritage93 and I'm back with the sequel to The Hangnail Story. In the last nail video, I mentioned how I've never experienced this many hangnails at once. And if you're on the nails letter, you know some of the culprits, like moisture neglect, especially in the colder seasons. But in this video, I'm hanging up on these hangnails and the caresses once and for all, with a nail care routine to answer my call. Ready to go? Let's get started. Now, as with any other nail care routine, I'll need a few things, like an electric hair trimmer, some Jamaican black castor oil, a bit of tea tree oil, a grainy sugar scrub, some minty hand soap, a shea butter body cream, and a plastic cuticle pusher. First, I'll run my trimmer over my fingers to de-hair them. I like this little thing, it's technically a facial trimmer, great for removing facial fuzz, but I thought I'd give it a go for the nail care show. Next, I'm grabbing my oils to soothe the shaved skin and prevent those tiny little bumps from forming. Now, in a small cup, I'll pour a bit of castor oil and a splash of tea tree oil, and then heat it all up in the microwave for about 10 seconds. Then it's time to rub a generous amount of the oil all over my nails and cuticles. This treatment is so great for repairing and strengthening the natural nail, plus it feels amazing. Next, I'm grabbing a heaping chunk of the sugar scrub and rubbing it all over my hands. I absolutely love combining these two because the scrub clings to the oil, boosting each other's effects. And you gotta love a dynamic duo. Exfoliating is also a great way to gradually and naturally fade away dark marks and scarring on the skin. Now it's time for a semi-final rinsing before adding the hand soap to cut through the remaining oils. After all that oil soaking and scrubbing, now is the best time to work up the hidden layers under the cuticle that are just waiting for their time to wreak crust havoc once again. Now that the girls are nice and clean, I'll moisturize with that hand and body cream. You know, I honestly thought that these hangnails wouldn't stand a chance against all that soaking and scrubbing, but although they've held on this long, it's time for us to finally go our separate ways. My only regret was not using a more efficient clipper for this because, of course, this one was on joke time. It's like homegirl was struggling. It's like, is my cuticles too thick for you? Let me know. I'll take that, but yeah, it might be true because little Twiggy here just snapped off without any hubbub. So since the girls are hangnail free, I went on to file the curved edges straight. This helps prevent hangnails from popping up in the near future and is something I occasionally like to do as the girls grow longer. And now, to top off this routine, I'll add a light cuticle oil over each nail, followed by a few coats of clear. While I prep my nails for the next coat, I wanted to let you know about the new and improved Nails Letter Survey. Now, if you would love to get nail care stories, inspirations, and goodies from me delivered straight to your inbox, be sure to fill out the new survey to climb aboard the Nails Letter email list. So I made the Nails Letter to help keep you going strong on your nail care growth journeys, and I'm seriously enjoying my time with you guys over there. Oh, my emotions. So, for the new opt-in survey, I had to add the feedback from OG Nails Letter Tribe, as well as some new nail pictures as references to help me better understand your unique growing pains and, of course, your nail goals. Once you submit your survey answers, stay tuned for the official welcome and the Nails Letter goods that await your arrival. Definitely check out the description box for the official deets. So yes, I hope you girls enjoyed this hanging up on these hangnails type tutorial and found it helpful. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and engaging. Take care and happy nail growing. I'll see you in the next one.